how to do. This video demonstrates how to install NS3 on Ubuntu 18.04. To start you need three things on your computer, VMware Workstation, ISO of Ubuntu Operating System, and SSH Client. Next, create an Ubuntu Virtual Machine on the VMware Workstation using the Ubuntu.iso file. Then. Install the NS3 prerequisites on the Ubuntu Virtual Machine. After all that done, you can install NS3. Step 1. Create Ubuntu Virtual Machine on VMware Workstation. Click New Virtual Machine. Select Custom, Advanced. Click Next. Select Hardware Compatible. Click Next. Select I will install the operating system later. Click Next. Select Linux as a guest operating system and choose Ubuntu 64-bit. Click Next. Provide a name for the virtual machine and choose our location to save. Click Next. Change the number of processors and number of cores per processor. Click Next. Change the amount of memory allocated. Click Next. Select Use Network Address Translation. NAT or use bridged networking. Essential, your virtual machine can access the internet. Click Next. Select I.O. controller type, recommended LSI logic. Click Next. Select a disk type, recommended SCSI. Click Next. Select create a new virtual disk. Click Next. Adjust the disk size as required and choose either to store the file as a single file. Click Next. Specify the disk file name and location. Click Next. Now your virtual machine is ready to create. Click Finish. Insert image file.iso of Ubuntu 18.04. Click OK. Power on the virtual machine. As soon as the virtual machine boots, you'll see the welcome window. You can select your language from a list on the left and choose Installing Ubuntu. Choose your keyboard layout. Click Continue. Select Minimal Installation and select Download Updates while installing Ubuntu. Click Continue. Choose Erase Disk and Install Ubuntu. Click Install Now. Click Continue to fix those changes in place and start the installation process. Select your location and click Continue. Enter your name and computer name. The installer will automatically suggest a username. Enter a strong password and confirm it. Keeping automatic login disabled. Click Continue. The installer will now complete in the background, while the installation window teaches you a little about how awesome Ubuntu is. Depending on the speed of your machine and network connection, installation should only take a few minutes. After everything has been installed and configured, a small window will appear, asking you to restart your machine. Click on Restart now and remove the Ubuntu image file ISO from the virtual machine. Then press Enter. Enter your credential and click Sign In. Install VMware Tools. Open the VMware Tools CD mounted on the Ubuntu desktop. Open zip file. Then drag and drop VMware Tools distrib folder to the desktop. Open a terminal window. Navigate to the VMware Tools distrib folder.
when we run dot slash vmware install dot pl directly, we encounter drive access problem. To solve it, add sudo ult before the command. Enter your Ubuntu password. Accept the installation by entering yes. Restart the Ubuntu virtual machine. Enable SSH service in Ubuntu 18.04. Press Ctrl plus Alt plus T to open the terminal. Run this command to install open SSH service. Open your SSH client in your PC. Enter the IP address of Ubuntu Virtual Machine. Enter username and password of Ubuntu Virtual Machine. Step 2. Install NS3 prerequisites. Install requirements for C++. This is the minimal set of packages needed to run NS3 from a release tarball. Install requirements for Python. This is the minimal set of packages needed to work with Python bindings from a release tarball. Install requirements for Python development for use of NS3 all-in-one repository cloned from Mercurio. Additional packages are needed to fetch and successfully install PyBingen. Install NetAnim Animator. Qt5 development tools are needed for NetAnim Animator. Install support for NS3 PyViz Visualizer is based on GTK Plus version 3 and requires these packages. Install support for MPI-based distributed emulation. Install support for Bake Build Tool. Install Debugging Tool. Install support for utils check style.py code style check program. Download oxygen and related inline documentation. Download the NS3 manual and tutorial. Download new scientific library, support for more accurate with the error models. Install the network simulation cradle, NSE. Requires the Flex Lexical Analyzer and Bison Parser Generator. To read PCA packet traces, install this tool. Install database support for statistics framework. Install XML-based version of the config store. Install support for generating modified Python bindings. Install pip for Python 3. Install GTK-based configuration system. To experiment with virtual machines and NS3, install this tool. Install support for OpenFlow module. Step 3. Downloading and building NS3. In this demonstration we will download and build NS3 using Bake. This repository provided by default an NS3 all-in-one. 
we will go through a set of scripts to manage the download and build of the most commonly used NS3 subsystems. 1. Download the most recent copy of Bake. 2. Configure target version of NS3. 3. Check whether enough tools to download. 4. Downloading NS3. 5. Building NS3. 6. Show various dependencies of the build packages. 7. Testing NS3. Download the most recent copy of Bake. Configure target version of NS3. There are a few configuration targets available. 1. NS3.29, the module corresponding to the release, it will download components similar to the release tarball. 2. NS3 dev, a similar module, but using the development code tree. 3. NS all in one 3.29, the module that includes other optional features such as click routing, open flow for NS3, and the network simulation cradle. We configure this version to download in this demonstration. 4. NS3 all-in-one, similar to the released version of the all-in-one module, but for development code. Step into the workspace directory and type the following into your shell. Check whether enough tools to download. Downloading NS3. If you have encountered a download problem, just re-download NS3 again. Building NS3. Show various dependencies of the build packages. Testing NS3. Congratulations, your NS3 downloaded and built successfully.